I was I was excited when Converse reached out, you know, to do a, a track with him. It's a simple call, like, hey, do you want to do one of those Converse records? Oh yeah, with who? Mark, plus the people, like, oh yeah, great, let's do it. So in the beginning, uh, it was just the two of us, and we were kind of talking about, you know, what singers we wanted to use, and we we're bouncing ideas back and forth. And uh, my band just got back from Australia and, and saw Kimber play. She's got a really cool vibe, and that's, you know, that's, I wanted to do it with her. She's in Germany right now on tour, so this is going to be a, a multi-continental. Transatlantic. Transatlantic. Yeah, we're, we're channeling her spirit right now, and, and she is actually here with us. It's a transatlantic collaboration. Yep. I think yeah. music's made a lot like that these yeah, days, actually. Right. I think it's made more like that than, than you would think. each have sort of our areas of, of expertise in production and it's, it's very complimentary. I worked on the beat and then, you know, Mark's a great, you know, multi-instrumentalist and songwriter. So like I gave him a bass of the beat and then he just kind of wrote on top of it. That in itself brought the track to a whole other zone from what I would normally do by myself. You know, it's cool, just like tag teaming it too. We both work in Logic, so it's like, you know, he could get up and do something else and I could hop into the session and work yeah. and then we could switch spots and, and you know, just keep keep on building it, building it up. Mm -hmm. 